Hi, my name is Samuel Mensa. Um, I work as a lab production scientist and I studied MSc Pharmacology. Since graduation, um, I worked as a lab technician at the UK Biocenter for six months and then I moved on to um, where I currently work right now, um, MSD, and I work as a um, lab production scientist and I've been there since um, 2019, July 2019. What I enjoy most about my current job is that I get to improve, I get to develop the processes that we do and the company gives me room to develop and it progresses me as well, so I enjoy that. I chose University of Bedfordshire because it was it's closer to home, um, first of all, and the teacher-student ratio is quite really good. So that's one of the reasons, and obviously they have excellent facilities on site. So that's one of that's some of the reasons why I chose University of Bedfordshire. During my pharmacology course, I did learn a lot of transferable skills. Um, apart from the usual, you know, make team deadlines and making sure that I, I, I hit all my targets and stuff. Um, at my workplace, there's constant deadlines and I keep meeting them, I think mostly because of what I learned from the university. And also, um, during my final year project, I worked on cell culture and the things that I had a few failures when, while I was doing it and it's helped me because in as much as we learn from our victories we also learn a lot from our failures so in the outside world there are so many things that don't go your way but I always find a way to find a solution to it what we did wrong and where we can improve next so these things I learned while I was being a student at Bedfordshire University. For my final project, I did um, studies on cell culture and um, human breast cancer cells to be specific. I was working on um, two different drugs um, separately and in combination to see the effects they have in killing the human breast cancer cells. Um, I found out that the combination therapy was better in, in killing these cells rather than the single therapy. So it's a way forward, epigenetics. My tutors played a very vital role in shaping my industry career because most of the feedback I got from them helped me, the good and the bad ones helped me to be the kind of person I, I am now. So I learned a lot from the feedbacks they gave me and where I could improve, things that I could do differently and things that I can, I didn't even know I had it within me, you know. They helped bring everything, um, the best out of me. I really enjoyed, um, strangely, the lab work because I am quite a hands-on person. So especially during my project where I spent like three months in the lab, um, I had a few failures in the lab where we had to, we got the formulations, the um, concentrations of the drug wrong. So we had to start the whole process again and it was stressful, but at the same time it was fun because I really enjoyed working in the lab. So. Yeah, these are, that's, that's my best memory at Bedfordshire University. My ultimate goal, um, I want to get into um, a specialist kind of role where I train more people who come in and then I also look forward to improve the processes that I am working on right now and in, get involved in more projects for science. I will say that when you go out there, make sure companies are looking for people who can sell themselves. So make sure that whatever you have learned over here, make sure that when you go out there, you find a way to sell yourself before you apply for any job. Make sure that you tailor your CV specifically to the job and your, your academic experiences. Bring your academic experiences out there and make sure that it's in line with the company's policies as well. The University of Bedfordshire is a great place and it's, it was the start of my career, it put me out there. I would definitely recommend it for anyone who wants to do um, either undergrad or postgraduate studies. It's, it's, got an, it's got excellent facilities, the tutors here are amazing, um, lectures, seminars, conferences, 
um, to the point where there are, we get um, external um, lecturers and external people come in and talk to us about career and all that. So I really enjoy these things. I would definitely recommend it. And if I could do this again, I would do it over and over again. The advice I'll give to the life science students is enjoy the journey as it goes. I think most, most of the students are focused on the final destination and I want to be a scientist, that's when I'm going to be happy and all that. We don't take time to enjoy the little victories, you know, our targets, our exams and all that. So enjoy the journey as you go and don't always wait for the target or that destination to be happy in life. Mm -hmm.